all right good morning welcome back to another video and you, something different today and um, you'll see by the title that we're actually going to go and fish a, a competition so used to fish competitions for years always did um i sort of stopped stuck mainly with the the ireland qualifiers which was probably my main competition then that i would have fished every year still do um but this year we i have decided that i wanted to do more competitions i wanted just to give it a bit of a blast something different change things up again uh the one in particular that we're going to fish today again possibly already on the title it's the the upper urn predator challenge i think something like that competition has been running for a good few years now tends to get very good numbers um i sort of didn't fish it because of the whole blue barrel situation which they have now changed hence the reason why i'm fishing it again i don't really want to get into that too much but that is uh that's the main reason yeah so now um, i'm gonna go and give it a go show a bit of support and uh show that that's you know that's going to be the way forward i think with uh, with this style of fishing uh using the the floating slings and whatnot um two day competition i'm gonna be a bit of a a bank tramp i think and sleep in the car we'll see how that goes again i'm a bit big for sleeping in the back of a car but um a couple of tins of beer maybe sort that out uh and yeah that's it as far as i know it is biggest fish wins over the two days the zone itself isn't the the biggest it's also not an area given the place where we're going that i actually fish quite a lot um so it'll be interesting to see i think the water uh, clarity up there isn't great at the minute it's a bit a uh, bit murky with the rain and stuff that we've been getting so it's going to be quite interesting to see how that goes um all methods really so fly fishing uh trolling dead bait i think everything is allowed except for the use of live scope um so i'll have to take that off the boat but yeah that's it um that's the new the new setup for my uh for my jerk baits hard baits and things just just because I'm quite pleased with getting that set up. Um, but anyway, that's it. We'll see you on the water. Okay, here we go. Most of the boats have already launched. They're all in the jetty over there. Bit of a mess to try and get set up in here, first and foremost. Just a bit. Yeah. All right, all the boats. 60 boats, I think, is meant to be out today. A wee bit of wind. Hoping it's not too choppy. Water looks okay-ish. Interesting to see how that goes now. We're gonna make our way into the registration. Just getting ready to start. They're letting the smaller boats go off first, so anything less than 20 horsepower is going first, then the bigger boats. Then tomorrow that will be the bigger boats off first. Right, rods are out. Sort of didn't video the start because it was carnage. Rods everywhere, boxes flying everywhere, boats all going as quick as they can to, to get out. But we're trolling. Some of them big yokes. But it's just up to me now to try and stay in the deep water. But that's it, we're fishing anyway. Dave's just getting the sling. Got the deadbaits rods out now, we've stopped trolling and we're doing a bit of casting on, on one of my custom made jerk baits. Look at that. Yo! Haven't seen anybody else catching anything yet. It's tiny, I don't even know if I should really call it in and get it weighed, but I haven't seen anybody else catching fish, so I think it would be silly not to. Horrible weather, hailstones, Dave's got a fish. I've come into a sheltered bay, I've sort of put the dead baits down and we're just casting lures. Hard to get the keep the screen clean, but we're just casting lures, namely my lures. Dave has just lifted one of my uh, Snaker Sad Juniors and caught. But it's bigger than what we have. I've actually had three fish, but I haven't filmed them because they were quite small. Um, and this is definitely the biggest one we've had so far. So I'll show the hold it properly and we get a look at you, Dave. Give it a wee wipe. Uh, there we go. It'd be funny if that got us into the money. Okay. So we're doing a bit of trolling with the disco pike. 
with one of my snacker curry tails on and we've had a nice fish finally. The weather's shocking. Here we go, snacker curly tail and the disco head. We're getting the fish wet now. Just add a wee bit on, sure. <laughs> you need to add a wee bit on, though, I think, for us to even get into the. Uh. That's rough out there now, isn't it? Oh, it's I know, it would have been alright for the Ireland qualifiers, I think. Really? I'd have swore that was a bigger fish, but. <laughs> Isn't that bad? Long and yeah. There you go. Can I hold it up for a little bit? Big man. Simon Gibson. Hook five. Hook five. Get plenty of fish, but a lot of small ones. I think that's seven or eight we've had now. Right. Put your cut off there now. I would say 10 pounds will be the cut off, yeah. I would think. Well, we're so getting close. I'll, I'll read you out. Oh, I, I, we have the, the two wee ones of yours and then that, that cub's fish and this is all the fish. Yeah. 9 pounds, 16 pounds, 7 pounds, 13 pounds, 10 pounds, 15 pounds, 10 pounds, 10 pounds, 12 pounds, 14 pounds, 11 pounds, 9 pounds, 10 pounds, 8 pounds, 8 pounds. Yeah, that, right. All very similar, a lot of them, aren't yeah. they? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. You're, you're, you're talking to be up around that, that eight, ten pound a one. Yeah, you you want want I think. Fifteen plus. Ah, uh, you need know, fifteen plus to be in the money, aren't yeah. you? Yeah. Good Thanks, stuff. Fred. Thank you very much. In a nice sheltered spot now. Just trolling. That last fish was eight pound eight, something like that. I can't remember. Definitely thought it was bigger than what it was, but anyway. Uh, eight fish we've caught now all together. Crazy the amount of fish we're catching, but all small. Um, lots of fish in round to the 10, 9, 10 pounds. So, main aim is just to try and hit something high double, 18, 19, 20 pound. It's just hoping for the best, really. Fish on, just as on the slider. On the slider. Yeah. Any size? Nah. I think I just nah. caught, caught that on camera just as you done it. That's the way to bring them in to see that store from the Yeah. <laughs> Maybe a bit more, but we'll get it in the sling and call the guys to come and let us in. Right, grab the sling there. 
here we go. There's the one that done the damage, the last two fish. So we've got the disco head, my curly tail. Is that one of the... 12, Twelve That's what I said, about 12, so happy days. Simon Gibson. And then it's, we're straight run back here now to get back in time, aren't we? Five. Five? Yeah. Yeah. Is that one of the bigger ones for you today? Aye, but I mean just in general, like average. It's up there, yeah. We've only got about nine or ten now. Yeah. It's gonna be a bit of a speed, you know? Yeah. Just switch on and switch off. That's it. Cheers, Ed. Good man. Twelve six. Let's go. Need to get back now to get back in time. Okay, day two. And the state of the boat. Running and gunning yesterday. So the scores came out. We we're sitting on tenth, tenth place with twelve pounds seven. Um, the conditions are a lot better today. I don't know if you can see from here. Probably not. But um, it'll be better fish caught today. I think it didn't rain really any, any much. That's even the term. I slept in the back of the car last night, so my head's still a bit fuzzy. Didn't get a great night's sleep. But that's all part and parcel of the fun. Um, yeah, so we're gonna go down, get the boat tidied up, get it launched. They have been as helpful as always. And uh, yeah, day two on the way. Okay, day, day two, I'm gonna kick off here now, it's very soon. It looks like there's even more boats today. Obviously a few people are just fishing the one day. Weather well, definitely looks a lot better. I'm feeling there's going to be better fish caught today. 21 pound, two twenties caught yesterday. Iron giant took one of the dead baits. Wonder was that the uh, one that maybe had a bite at your at your lure? Yeah, you? it was. Yeah. Yeah, that's a that's, that's a big fish. Mate, that's that's a twenty. That yeah. that could be pushing the pushing right. the winner. Yeah. Ten. There you go, Dave's fish. Lovely. There we have it. So. Came around, got it weighed. It was, <coughs> it was 18 pound on the nose. Um, spawned out fish, so definitely 20 plus a month ago or so. Um, but hopefully that's like 18 pounds, good fish. That, that should put us in in the money. You know, we'd be very, uh, very disappointed if you weren't uh, weren't in the money with an 18 pound fish. That's for sure. Um, hopefully top five. That's what we're aiming for. Dave still fishing away. I'm gonna have a bit of lunch now because I need a refill and. Uh, yeah, I think the plan is once the battery runs out on the trolling motor, we're going to stick the big lures on, troll with the big engine, maybe them sort of things, just to give you a bit of context of the size of those. <laughs> um, maybe big units like that. Just to, you know, we've done what we needed to do now. Try and get a bigger one, hopefully. But the rain's staying away, which is the main thing. Back trolling again for a while, but we're trolling on the big engine now. The wind's sort of helping us keep the right, keep the right speed and whatnot. Um, but yeah, we've done quite a bit of casting there. We've drifted with the dead baits. We've had a lot of fish. Money we get twelve. Yeah, twelve. Twelve fish. So that's. 
Yeah, um, it's 20 fish over the two days, so we're going well in terms of numbers. Obviously, we've got the big one as well, thankfully. Um, we have about an hour left, so that's it. We'll really just sort of keep plugging away. Hopefully, one of these go. Trolling reasonably big lures. If this one goes in, we're we're laughing. So, yeah, let's go. Okay, here we go. Home time. Um, it's actually the day after, <laughs> as you can tell by my face. Um, the wind over the last two days were horrible. But anyway, um, our 18 pounder that we got, we finished in third place out of uh, 61 boats. Probably over 100 anglers, give or take. Um, so super result for the first sort of major competition of the year. Really, really pleased. Um, myself and Dave have fished, you know, numerous competitions over the years, and we've had a fair share of uh, success in a few of them. And obviously, there's been quite a few that haven't been quite as good. So it's always uh, always nice uh, to get rewarded at the end of it because uh, there is a bit of effort and things that got to go into it. So well, definitely, um, big shout out to the actual event uh, organizers because it was very, very good, very well run, um, and you know, looking forward to the next one already. So. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Uh, you know, it's one of those ones where the rain and wind made it difficult to sort of film as much as I would have liked. Um, it's it just got a sort of a bit of a, an inside a glimpse into what went on and, and what to expect and, and whatnot. But anyway, I hope you've enjoyed it nonetheless. So, catch us on the next video.